Hello everyone, my name is Otrupa and welcome back to another episode of the How to Install LSPDFR 2021 Updated Guide. Today I'm going to show you guys how to install all the basic plugins that you need in your LSPDFR. So starting this off, I'm going to show you guys how to install Stop the Ped, moving on to Ultimate Backup, and then moving on to a basic callout pack, literally called Basic Callout, and all these mods are going to be listed down in the description below. But before we go any further, I never usually do this, I'm going to have to start doing it because we are not gaining as many subscribers as we used to so if you can please be sure to subscribe it takes five seconds and then you can always unsubscribe later if you really want to but i can guarantee you will not want to because i always put out some pretty useful content when it comes to lspdfr so please be sure to subscribe like the video and comment down below what video you want to see next but other than that what you guys want to do is click the first download link down in the description below that's going to bring you guys right here to stop the ped hit download and download that if you do not have an ad blocker it might redirect you just close that page and try downloading it again and then it should let you download it they gotta make money some way then go to the next download link down in the description below that's bringing you guys right here to ultimate backup and do the exact same thing it's on the exact same website and then open that one on up and for basic call outs do the exact same thing hit the link down in the description below go to download this file agree and download and then just click here to speed it up a little bit just like that and minimize that now you can close your browser or whatever you're using and you guys are going to want to navigate to your gta5 file directory so to do that go to everdrive install gta5 on and those of you guys on steam i'm going to show you guys how to get to your game right now but for those of you guys on epic games and rockstar games your gta5 main directory will be down in the description below but what you guys are going to want to do on steam is go to whatever drive you installed your gta5 on on your steam go to program files a6 go down to steam steam apps and common choose a gta5 folder that you want to mod but mine's not going to be there because i made a custom file because it was easier but now i'm starting to regret it because i always have to do that and now choose a gta5 folder you want to mod for me it's going to be this one right here i believe no it's definitely not this one right here it's this one right here the one with no plugins in and then grab your ultimate backup or whatever one first doesn't really matter for the stop the plug stop the paired plugins and just grab both these files and drag and drop them in and now for your ultimate backup one, or you stop the pad even, whatever it is, do the exact same thing. Grab both of these and drag and drop it in. You can close that. And then for your last one, which is going to be basic callouts, go to the basic callouts folder and just grab both of these folders and drag and drop it in. It's going to ask you to replace a couple of files. Hit yes. And just like that, you've now successfully already within 2 minutes and 50 seconds installed your first three plugins that's going to be pretty much everything you need and for now on the most stuff you install now will just be creature comfort which is really really cool so you've basically your whole lsbfr is set up if you've been watching the rest of my tutorials so what you guys want to do now is go into plugins and lspdfr and right here this should be all the plugins we just installed so basic callouts stop the bed and on the backup which is pretty cool and now I'm going to walk you guys through what these files do. So pretty much the only thing you need to do, you need to know what controls which, is this file right here, which is the any. And if you right click on it and go into edit, this I believe doesn't have many options, but you can disable and enable callouts just by changing it from enabled to disabled and disabled to enabled. It's pretty, uh, you know, you can make it out yourself. It don't really need much explaining. Exactly the same with stop the ped, although this does have a lot more options, so it can get a little bit confusing. And you can just list the exact control key if you are unsure which keys are valid and what you need to call them you can just check out this link right here which will show you which controls which and then exactly the same for the ultimate backup plugin just like that you can also see what key you need to work everything but what i'm going to do now is going to hop in game and i'm going to show you guys working it in game working it in game working in game and i'm going to show you guys how to use them okay so once we're in the game the first thing you guys are going to want to do to open up your stop the pad all you guys are going to want to do is hit g and just like that, you should be able to navigate through your stop the ped menu. You can request a vehicle check. If I stand in this vehicle right here, it will request a vehicle check on the Shafter 49AFX724. A traffic violation. Approach with caution. And just like that, very, very loudly, it should give you um, it should give you the status check on the vehicle. As you guys can see, it was like inspired. Uh, not everything's marking as expired, but just for some reason, for the first one we scanned, it actually was expired, which is quite interesting. And then also, you can do uh, searching the vehicle, like this. 
and it will give you a little menu showing you guys how to do it showing you guys what was in the car even you can also request a tow service call vehicle insurance stop and slow down traffic and disable your realistic weapon system which is a thing that limits you to picking up certain weapons and only allows you to have certain so like scopes and things like that on that weapon as for your ultimate backup if you press b you will notice that it's going to be overlapping other controls so to do that go into your lspdfr and go to key bindings but first of all make sure you're not on controller to change that and then go down to ultimate backup to go to backup menu and just hit space to clear key and then exit out of it and now if you hit b again it should no longer pop up with your menus and just the ultimate backup menu here you can request uh, uh, support, I was trying to look for the word there, support Code 2, no lights and sirens even though they will respond lights and sirens because it's broken Code 3 which is lights and sirens and normally like a police officer with a Glock or whatever and then you can also request additional units depending on the code that you're requesting so Code 2 you can request a police bike, supervisor, female and patrol units, pretty much just patrol units Code 3 you can just select patrol units, tactical SWAT units, emergency, first responder, first responder fire air ambulance and air swap backup and you can also spawn in a partner spawn in with the player's outfits just like that just spawn in front of you although he's uh oh no he's over here somewhere I, I don't know where the hell he is he's somewhere so it should spawn in front of you i think he's gone into the abyss and you can also recruit the nearest partner you can make him have a different vehicle when he spawns into you and he'll follow you and you can give him different handgun selections and you can also update his weapons so you don't have to keep spawning and deleting him and other than that, that is pretty much it. Oh no, never mind. You have a K9 partner, which is pretty much the exact same thing as the partner partner, the non-K9 partner, if you know what I'm saying. And as for your callout, you can check if it's working by going to LSPDFR, going to callouts, and you should be able to see here that it will say callout provided by basic plugins. And you can click force callout. And just like that, you can accept it like I've been over already, and you can go to respond to it if you want. But other than that, that's going to be the end of this video. Hope you guys did enjoy. Please, please, pretty please be sure to subscribe, like the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers and goodbye.